This is my quick tip on how to use the history brush, which is a forgotten brush. Let's say, hypothetically, that I would want this finger to be thinner. Now for that, I would use the liquify tool. Now if you jump into liquify, then what you can do is we get the forward walk tool and we are just going to make that finger thinner, right? Nice, thin fingers. Now, obviously I wouldn't do that otherwise, just for demonstration purposes. And, but now this finger is warped as well. We need to do something about it. I can't just go back into liquify, so I'm going to use the history brush. I just need to set it somewhere where it wants to go back to. I need to go back in time to the uh, default initial stage, so I set my history brush just right there. And now if I brush with it, I can just go back in time and basically that would be it. I'm Victor Fayish, and if you want to learn more tips like this, then check out my latest class on retouching at calbyone.com.